Following over two years of development and nearly two million pre-orders, investors and automobile enthusiasts have been waiting for news regarding Tesla's Cybertruck. It seems that they are in luck since Elon Musk has recently made some disclosures. Let's get the specifics from PR whiz man in, but with some questions first. Hi Rel. Indeed, a grinning Elon Musk shared a production candidate of the Tesla Cybertruck on Twitter yesterday. In relation to this, it simply indicates that the vehicle in question most likely rolled off the line. To find out if the line is generating cars that are good enough to sell, they are testing it. Well, maybe not quite close enough, but this one won't be offered to consumers. He was ecstatic at the time, but a lot of people noticed some intriguing panel gaps and production problems that were remarkable and not very good for a car that will serve as a major focal point of Tesla's product offensive online and in Tesla message boards. Even Elon Musk noticed these little flaws, and he wrote an internal email to Tesla engineers saying, due to the nature of the Cybertruck, which is made of bright metal with mostly straight edges, any dimensional variation shows up like a sore thumb. The future is set to change thanks to Tesla's Cybertruck. This groundbreaking car is evolving into a next-generation automobile from a simple pickup truck. Imagine a day in the future when the Cybertruck is designated as the official vehicle for thrilling and valiant missions. We can't wait to see this come to pass. It's almost here. We're excited to share some really exciting news with you today regarding Tesla's futuristic pickup truck, which has been making waves since it was unveiled in 2019. The Cybertruck was an unusual vehicle with a large touchscreen, a stainless steel body, and a 500-mile range, as you may recall. However, did you know that the Cybertruck might soon emerge as the police car of the future? Yes, it will be the best means of advancing law enforcement to a completely new degree. Our next generation police vehicle will be released shortly. It's amazing. In fact, Elon loves it even more than I do. It's my favorite police vehicle. I have too much knowledge about it, some of which is still secret. Nevertheless, it has a stainless steel body, is incredibly quick and safe, and we don't need to add a screen because we currently use their cameras and screen to display our application for users inside Tesla cars. You can use a Tesla car, or you can use a non-Tesla car that we can improve. Everything is operational and has been placed in Stanislaus County. There is only one command center, as far as the police and, I guess, the fire are concerned. Stan County is a rural area in California, close to Yosemite Valley, and the summers there are getting drier, naturally. Furthermore, a location where brush fires are prone to occur. We are particularly concerned about brush fires and firemen, who are stationed in isolated areas without cell service. Thus, we must use robotic drones to safely alert firefighters and use satellites for communication with firefighters. The Cybertruck garnered a lot of attention upon its initial release from Tesla, in part because of its distinctive appearance and innovative features. But while some adore its unique and futuristic appearance, others detest its sharp, boxy shape. There has been a lot of information throughout the years regarding the Cybertruck's impending debut, and some Tesla enthusiasts have even placed pre-orders for the truck. The Cybertruck is going to be in high demand, as evidenced by its enormous fan base, so it's definitely something to look forward to. However, some enthusiasts have more ambitious ambitions for the Cybertruck than this. One such enthusiast is Larry Ellison, a major Tesla investor and co-founder of Oracle who recently revealed his most recent plan for the vehicle. This plan is unique and looks like it will be quite fascinating. Hey everyone, happy to be back at Tesla tomorrow. Former Tesla board member and co-founder of Oracle Larry Ellison recently disclosed his intention to create a police car of the future modeled after the Tesla Cybertruck. Ellison revealed this information while showcasing a model of a Cybertruck that had Oracle livery, emergency lights, sirens, and even a bull bar at Oracle's Cloud World 2023 conference in Las Vegas. The Cybertruck was hailed by the Tesla Bull for its creative layout, performance, safety features, and onboard technology, all of which he claimed would make it the perfect vehicle for first responders and law enforcement. In addition, he asserted that he knew too much about the Cybertruck, suggesting that it had certain unreported characteristics that would have increased its already amazing features.
This is especially intriguing as the Cybertruck has garnered recognition for its exceptional attributes, which are already well known. Speaking of further unannounced features, therefore, implies that investors and Tesla enthusiasts have more to look forward to in the upcoming months. Before we go any further, please remember to hit the bell notification button to stay informed about all that Tesla is up to. If you enjoy this kind of content, don't forget to like and subscribe. The Cybertruck is equipped with a glass roof that can withstand sledgehammers and bullet impacts, a stainless steel body that resists dents and corrosion, a roomy cabin that can accommodate up to six people, a large bed that can carry 3,500 pounds of cargo, and an adaptive air suspension system that allows the ride height and damping to be adjusted. With its sophisticated self-driving system that uses cameras, radar, and ultrasonic sensors to manage traffic and prevent collisions, the truck boasts amazing performance numbers. Not only is the impending introduction of the truck exciting for auto aficionados, but it may also have a significant effect on Tesla's stock performance. Given the substantial boost to the automaker's revenue, a successful launch and a favorable reception by the market may help to bolster investor confidence. Given that Tesla's revenue is on the high side, its stock price may rise sharply, increasing earnings for both investors and CEO Elon Musk. It's undeniable that Tesla accounts for a sizable amount of Musk's riches, but the billionaire who made his fortune from the stock market boom isn't the only one. When Ellison joined the Tesla board at the very end of 2018, that is when his ownership in the company was first made public. As for the investor, he joined the board in 2018 after Tesla announced that Ellison had bought 3 million shares at an undisclosed price earlier in the year, when he was worth $58.4 billion, following the SEC's mandate that the company have two independent directors as part of their settlement over Musk's infamous tweet about taking Tesla private at $420 per share. Just over 15 million Tesla shares were owned by Larry Ellison as of October 2021, making him the automaker's second-largest individual shareholder behind Musk. This occurred during the week that Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, surpassed all previous global wealth holders. Knowing that Ellison is more than just a Tesla investment is intriguing. In fact, Ellison claimed to be personal friends with Elon Musk when he revealed his Tesla stake in 2018, and it seems that the two are still close to this day. It makes sense why he is so fascinated with Tesla. It appears that Ellison's decision to use Tesla's Cybertruck is quite intriguing. He said Oracle would implement software solutions for police work, including cloud-based apps, satellite and terrestrial networks, artificial intelligence, AI, and other incredible capabilities, using the Cybertruck's current screen and cameras. Additionally, he declared that Oracle's technology will, in his words, never fail, be dependable, secure, and resilient. Though this might sound a little too idealistic, it's also important to take into account whether Ellison is the only one who believes the Cybertruck would be a fantastic law enforcement vehicle. Even Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, has stated his enthusiasm for the Cybertruck as a cutting-edge law enforcement vehicle. He has even said that the truck was inspired by the science fiction film Blade Runner, which is set in a dystopian future. When the Cybertruck was unveiled back in November 2019, it garnered a lot of interest as well as criticism. While some are impressed by its features and powers, others question its viability and usefulness. Nevertheless, the Cybertruck appears to have attracted the interest of some of the most powerful people in the computer sector, despite public perception to the contrary. A new era of law enforcement driven by electric vehicles and cloud computing may be ushered in by Tesla Bull and Ellison's ambitions to convert the Cybertruck into a police vehicle. It remains to be seen if this is a good or bad thing. This revised version ought to be more lucid and cohesive. Please let me know if you have any other changes or additions.